Borstal Boy Punk Opera World Premiere Performance will take place at HMP Aylesbury Prison next year. The original performance at King's Theatre Portsmouth was postponed earlier this year. Here is the original Portsmouth News write-up. Saturday, March the 1st, 2014. Chris Owens, interviewer. Dave Clark followed his elder brother in a life of crime, but found redemption when he converted to Christianity. He wrote a book about his life and has now transformed it into a punk opera. When Dave Clark wrote his book about his misspent youth as a criminal, he meant to warn people against crime. But after penning his autobiography, the 65-year-old former college lecturer decided that to reach more people, he needed to change format. So he teamed up with a former student and his classic punk rock cover band and has now turned it into a punk opera which gets its world premiere at King's Theatre Southsea next month. The book, Borstal Boys, tells the tale of David's life growing up in Aylesbury before he moved to Fareham in 1988 and was written after his criminal brother, two and a half years older than him, also converted. Even a year locked away in Dover Borstal in 1967 did not make Dave stop his life of crime. It was only what he describes as a bad trip on LSD whilst watching Easy Rider in 1970 that changed his life. He claims that at that moment God saved him. And that key moment forms the focal point of his book, which is the central flank of this opera, which has been designed to be performed in the prisons of the UK. As we chat in the box at the theatre, Dave looks around this grand old place and says, I can't believe we're getting the chance to perform a punk opera in this wonderful building. Having the chance to put it on here really gives my life story mainstream credibility. He adds, the stories in my book are suited to punk, but not exclusively, and I intend to produce a mod musical that relates to the life of my brother.